Hello again, boys and girls. It's time for Super Science with Sarah. So I know that we have been working a lot lately with things that we can find around the house, and we've definitely used some of the things that we're using today before. We're going to use some baking soda, and you guessed it, vinegar. And we're going to use them to inflate this lovely balloon. So to do this, you're going to need your vinegar, your baking soda, obviously your balloon, but also an empty water bottle. So, like we did with the exploding bag, the mixture of the baking soda and the vinegar will create some carbon dioxide gas. So you're going to pour a good amount of vinegar in there. Check that out. You can put a little bit more if you want. I'm just going to put that amount because I don't want to use too much. We don't want too big of a reaction. So the tricky part is you're going to take this balloon and you're going to put the baking soda in it. To do this, you're going to need a funnel. So, as we did last week with our paper, you're going to make a lovely paper funnel. So you make a cone, you got to make sure there's a hole in the bottom of it. Just like that. And you're going to stick that inside the lovely mouth of the balloon. Gotta hold on tight. See, it's giving me a hard time here. You could also tape it down. So, and then you're gonna fill it up with a decent amount of baking soda. You're going to make sure it goes down into the balloon. Oop, oh no, oh, I've made a mess. Okay, so you're going to make sure some of it ends up inside this balloon. Now, any of my Bridgewood friends, we've done this before. Um, some of you may remember that I did it with a balloon that had a hole in it, and it exploded everywhere. That's not going to happen this time, hopefully. So, if you'll notice, it's all grainy at the bottom. There is now baking soda in the bottom of this balloon. So you're going to take your bottle. You're going to take your balloon. You're going to stretch it over the mouth of your bottle so that the baking soda is in the balloon, the vinegar is in the bottle, and the balloon is fully over the top of this bottle. It's made a perfect seal. Now comes the fun part. You're going to pick up the balloon, hold on tight, dump in the baking soda, it's going to react with the vinegar, making your carbon dioxide gas, which fills your balloon. So you don't have to blow it up. Science has filled it for you. So you can slide the balloon off of the bottle, which sometimes can be a bit tricky, while pinching it so that the air doesn't come out. Set your bottle aside. and tie up your balloon. Oh, I'm not very good at this. So, three, two, one. Ta-da! You didn't even have to use your own mouth to fill this balloon. You used science. So, until next time, I'm Sarah. Stay safe.
have fun, and keep learning.